Hi kids! Welcome to the very first episode of Keys Kids. And this is my channel and I'm Miss Keys. I'm so happy you were able to join me today. Today we will be reading a fabulous book called Don't Touch My Hair by Shereen Miller. Shereen Miller is our wonderful author. An author is the person who wrote the book. I know you're excited to get going today. Now this will be the first book in our April series. In our April series, we will be covering summary. Now, now, don't click off, don't click off. I know summary is a big thing. I know it's hard a lot of the times, but I got a secret for you. We are going to be working on the five finger method. Somebody wanted, but so then five finger. The somebody is just letting us know who our main character is. Wanted, what did your main character want? But this is our big one. This is the top of the book. This is where we're going to find our problem. Remember? So, so what happened? What did the main character try to do to solve the problem? And then, then what happened at the end of the story? This is going to be an amazing ride. I'm super excited. And I know this sounds hard, but we're going to keep working on it together so that we can master summaries. I know it was hard for me, but I had to keep practicing. And the more you practice, the easier it'll get. I promise. Are you guys ready? I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I know I am. Don't Touch My Hair by Sheree Miller. I'm Aria, and this is my hair. She got a lot of hair, y'all. I love my hair. It's soft and bouncy and grows up towards the sun like a flower. I love it up or down, styled or wild. I don't care. I just want it to be free. Actually, everyone loves my hair too. When I walk down the street, I hear so many compliments. It's so big. How do you get it so fluffy? I wish I had hair like that. It's great that people love my hair, but some love it so much they want to touch it. I don't like this. Girl, you and me both. What does it feel like? They are so curious about my hair that they try to touch it without even asking for permission. Oh, I want to feel. Me too. I get very good at avoiding hands. I have to start looking for ways to hide my hair. Whoa, 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 whoa. She no kung fu, y'all. I try blending in with the scenery, but I'm quickly spotted. Over here! Mm -mm -mm. I try hiding underwater, but that doesn't last long. Oh, wow, I love your hair. Can I touch it? She can't even hide under the water. They are everywhere. I escape to the jungle, but the critters just can't keep their hands to themselves. Let me touch it. Me first. No, me. 
I know no monkey finna touch my curls. I feel you, Aria girl. You better run, honey. Even in the tallest castle tower, someone is always there, ready and waiting to touch my hair. Girl, your hat is fierce. That dragon remind me of Beyonce, y'all. She all pink and purple. Okay, that's No matter how far I go, it doesn't seem to matter. How did you get it so big? Ooh, y'all, Arya just can't get away. Even the aliens are trying to get her. Mm-mm, girl, mm-mm. Finally, I find a place where no one wants to touch my hair. But after a few hours... I get lonely. Oh, that's sad. I decide to go home. And everybody there waiting for her too. Look, she got the monkeys up here, the dragon, even the aliens came waiting for Arya to come home, y'all. Mm-mm-mm. I try my best to ignore the attention, but as a hand sinks into my hair, wow, it looks so soft. Oh, it is soft. I decide I can't take it no more. That's it. That's enough. Don't touch my hair. This is my hair. It's great that you love it. I love it too. But please, just look and don't touch without my permission. That's right, girl. You better stand up for yourself. The next time someone wants to touch my hair, they ask, Can I touch your hair? I reply, Not today. Okay. No means no. Now it feels great to walk down the street without anyone trying to touch my hair. My curls are free to reach for the sun just like a flower. Some people still ask to touch my hair, but if I say no, they listen. How are you today? Hello. Man, they finally start saying hey instead of just bothering her about her hair. That's great. But if you ask nicely, sometimes I say yes. The end. Wow, what an amazing story. Thank you again to Sheree Miller for this amazing story. I really loved it. And I really could relate because of my own curls. So now that we're finished, we can finally work on our summary. I know, I know, y'all are still worried, but don't worry, I have your back. So remember our secret, our five finger method. Somebody wanted, but so then. It's super easy. Somebody, the somebody is your main character. Who was our main character? It was Aria. Good job, guys. Wanted. What did Aria want? Aria wanted to live free with her curls and let them grow towards the sun. But, remember, this is our tall finger, meaning this is our biggest thing in the story, our problem. What was the problem, guys? That's right. People kept touching Aria's hair with and without her permission. And that was a no-no. So, so what happened? Well, what happened was Arya ran from here to there. She went underwater. She went to the moon, even the jungle, honey, until she ended up on an island all by herself. Then, then what happened at the end? At the end of the story, Arya decided to stand up for herself and say, please don't touch my hair. 
It is my hair, not yours. And people started respecting her wishes. See, that wasn't so bad. Once you have all of that, you can now put it together in one big bowl and make your summary. In the story, Don't Touch My Hair, our main character was Arya. And Arya had these big, beautiful curls that she loved. But everyone kept touching her hair with and without her permission. So Arya decided to go underwater, to the jungle, even to the moon to get away. Then at the end, Arya decided to stand up for herself and tell people not to touch her hair without her permission. And people started respecting her wishes. The end. See, that wasn't so bad. To all my kids out there, you can do it. You now have the keys to the five finger method. Summaries in a snap. I hope to see you next week on the Keys Kids channel. Bye.